Okay, well, here's our dashboard. It says roof 101. We've got a water temperature gauge, and it's well below 200 degrees. We have a 10-pound oil fil our oil pressure system here. The switches are for the fan and for the fuel pump, which are down below. The uh, Model A engine here, which has a stock oil pump, it produces a nice steady six pounds of pressure with this system using 40 uh, weight 10 oil. Coming over here, we've got our, <coughs> this is our new manifold that's just for the roof. It can hold one, two, or three carburetors. Uh, linkage is yet to be designed. Some of the guys have come up with some different things. This thing back here is the water temperature takeoff. We've got two of them back here, so you can have a hot water heater, you could have a temperature takeoff, you could even do a temperature sender for your electric fan. Down here we've got the side uh, water inlet and it also has a boss on it down there so that you could add a water temperature sender or hot water uh, device for a heater. Coming around over here we've added an alternator. We've got uh, a 1932-33 water pump. The fan blades have been removed for this purpose because we have an electric fan set up on this. Uh, Nissan uh, radiator. Over on this side you can see down below our custom cast iron Y headers, the split header system. We have the roof port covers on each place and right here you have the oil line which runs down and comes off of the port. One line goes up here to the oil pressure gauge and the other one of course goes to the head. Uh, the black parts are the rocker box system with the covers and manganese bronze. The black part is an aluminum, the red part is cast iron. The distributor is a Model B distributor for test purposes. I probably would use something else uh, other than this, but for an uh, engine stand this works out pretty good. It's an electronic conversion on the inside. I'll start it up now and you can see that it starts easily and sounds pretty cool. 